YouTube, Bird Billy here. Today I'm going to talk about uh, my favorite post hole digger. Um, this one in my left hand here is actually your traditional style digger. And uh, these have worked well over the years. But what happens when you, know, you push down on the ground, you squeeze it together, it clamps, you lift up, you open up, you dump them. What ends up happening is as you go down into the ground, there comes a point when you're about 18 inches, 20 inches, whatever, where you have to start opening your hole up to allow for this action because as you can see the angle, the hole, the top of the hole has to grow. On the style that I like, and the one that I, I use is this one by a company called Fiskers. It's got a real nice balance to it. It's probably actually a little lighter than the original one. The way the, uh, the two handles come up, they come up straight. When I grab it and I close, they're basically almost about the same opening as the hole most of the way up. So you can go much deeper with this style without opening up that hole. It's more efficient and the balance on these is actually easier to use. And once you just get comfortable with the digging and opening, which is actually the same movement as the other one, um, I, I, you don't want to switch back. These are a really good post hole digger. Now, one thing I'm going to call attention to, I've had this digger for a little while. The hinge has come loose. Kind of see that? I contacted Fiskers. I've sent that. You, I didn't see a number to call. You have to do an email. So I sent them a warranty claim. They sent me back confirmation of my warranty claim. I'm waiting to see how they handle it. These are supposed to be a lifetime warranty on this tool. So I'm going to do a follow-up video when I get my replacement, or if I do get it or if I don't get it. Either way, you guys are going to know how they handle the situation. But uh, if you're looking for a post hole digger, I do like these a lot. The Home Depots by me don't carry them anymore. Um, you can get them online at Home Depot. I think they run between like $60 and $80. They're a little more than their original style, but again, what you get out of them and the ease of using them, it's well worth the money in my opinion. Alright guys, I'll see you in the next video.